All right, guys, back with another one. We have a minor issue. So I painted the uh, bar and realized it's a little dark. So I'm gonna have a uh, solution to fix that. Right now I'm at Lowe's. And uh, also wanna fix the, uh, the countertop where the bar is. I'm gonna see if I can't find something to put down on the counter just to just to give it a minor look we'll probably brighten that area up just a little bit so guys yeah, got a couple options here and of course we're gonna go cheap as possible because I don't have it like that so we're going to I really like the three lights in a row so I'm gonna try to find something like that and I think this right here will do it I don't know the price on this yet, but shouldn't be that bad. I don't like the battery powered lights because they don't last a long time. I don't like all that. It's $12 though. Let's we'll see how much this bad boy right here costs. Alrighty. Alright, we're back from the hardware store. We got some supplies here. This is the problem I wanted to show y'all. It's a little dark over here, even though I have an LED strip lighter from about right here to right here, it still doesn't bring enough light, especially at night when I'm doing videos. So, I got a solution for it. I got these lights right here, which were really cheap. They're about $19 They're LED, so I don't have to worry about them for a long time. Um, we're going to open these bad boys up. I have an idea where I'm going to put it. I'm probably going to put one right here on this side, and one right here in the middle, and one right here. I need light, so when I'm videoing over here that you can actually see really good, really clear. And it makes the video quality a little bit better when there's good light. So that is my solution to fix that. So let's open this up right now. We're going to cut the bottom of this. It's pretty good I don't cut this one. And the plastic is sharp. It's pretty self-explanatory. Stuff. So, here's what I'm going to do. I've never used these lights before. So, I'm guessing. I don't know. Okay. And these are the screws right here. And this right here is the uh, source where it gets the power from. And I have a staple gun also, so I'm going to staple these up to the bottom of the cabinet. And it'll give it a fresh, neat look also. And again, this is something that anybody can do. And these are for under lighting, uh, under cabinet lighting. So, But for what I'm using it for, it's just to shine down a little bit of light on the, on the actual bar. Because it's just, that's just not cutting it. I'm going to use it. So when I'm not filming, I'm going to turn this off to save energy and just have that just to illuminate this area a little bit. But I think this is a pretty good alternative. And obviously I'm an idiot, so we're probably going to have to pause this video and uh, read the instructions. That's something I usually don't do. So we'll be right back, and when I come back, We'll actually probably have these lights separated to see what I, you know, what I have to do. Alrighty, I have these separated now. So all I did was push the plastic piece out. That's all I had to do the whole time. I know what. So again, I'll do this one. This one I haven't done yet. So there's a little missing piece of plastic right here. I just put my finger underneath there and pull the light out. That easy. So. We're going to grab these extensions, and I'm just going to put these together to see how far I have to mount these apart from each other. And go from there. So I want the middle light. Dead center in the middle. Like that. So I'm going to start off by putting the first, the first one in the middle. you want to start with the middle one because if you do the side one you might not get a dead center in the middle 
So you want to start off with the middle one, always. YouTube, we've done it again. And what we did just to, to this video is we did the chalk wall and it made it kind of dark. So we need light. So let there be light. Boom. That's simple. And see, again, this is giving this area a nice look. You can do it too. I got the light that's going to shine on top of this glass. All this was my vision. And I can honestly say it came out awesome. Come take a look with me. If you look over here, I stapled it to the wall. So it's an easy access. You don't see a lot of cords. It's stapled. It's clean. So when I want the lights off, bam. When I want them on, bam. That can outside the box. Clean, nice look. So our next step is going to be, we're going to put... Pretty much a, a, like a vinyl sticker on the top of this. Just to give it a little bit, you know, brighter over here. Make it look a little clean, a little bit more organized. So, um, I got this right here. You can buy this at Lowe's for about $9. So, it's called Pill and Stick. And it's a, a granite texture. Let's see if this has actually got a texture to it. Because I don't, I don't believe. I mean, it's just a big cheap sticker. Okay. I do have to say, it is, it is pretty thick. Let's go over here in the light. We actually got light now, people. We actually got light. It is a little thick. Uh, it's pretty good. It feels like plastic. It is plastic, but I just was expecting it to feel like a, a, a shiny sticker to be honest with you what do you think yeah. so all right we're gonna take all this off again so we'll just fast forward us completely take this all this stuff off again so let's do it Thank 
And this small bar update is completely done now. Um, I like the way it looks. It's giving me a whole bunch more light, and that's what I wanted. So I'm okay with the with the looks of it. But is it 100% what I like? It is what it is. But anyway, um, I'm pretty much showing what you can do to your kitchen or bar for really cheap. I mean, this stuff was only nine dollars. I'm not losing. Um, the lights were probably, uh, what was it, 1999 or 1982, 1985, something like that. The lights were really cheap. And the LEDs, so I don't have to worry about them for a very long time. I like that. Anytime I can actually win and get a cheap price on an update is pretty cool. So, again, I'm just showing you all what you all can do, give you all ideas. Again, like, comment, and subscribe. And tell me what you all want to see. Um, 
we're not running out of ideas, but we would like ideas. But anyway, drink responsible. Um, I'm sorry, I've been drinking a little bit, so uh, drink responsibly. And um, have a nice night. I'm gonna keep starting on my words. <laughs>